prayer for St. Angie Extravaganza, a mother's prayer. No lady is sure at night, least of all your daughters, but it is a known fact that a woman do carry an evening bag. Into it pour the milk of your breast, rhinestones and antioxidants, a fan of lace and daggers, cracked maces of lipstick on squares of toilet paper. May your lips be pole stars, flashing for girls who die far from home. project is called Sacred Kitsch, and it is about uh, creating queer religious artifacts. So I have created a, a collection of queer saint cards um, that feature queer historical and pop cultural figures um, with prayers on the back that I've also written. My focus in this project is uh, creating what Jose Esteban Munoz calls signs of an existing queer reality. Um, and really I, I intend to create as many of these signs as I can. Prayer to Dorian Corey. As we, the old bulls, are bucked out by the young, we pray you take pity on us, Miss Dorian that we may fire the arrow of ambition high and far, that we may leave a mark on this earth. You say, if you just get through it, you say, pay no attention to the desiccated corpse in the closet. He has always been there. As a queer person, um, I don't think you encounter a lot of things um, that people would say are, you know, both queer and holy. Um, and so I think there's uh, something kind of empowering in making those, um, in, you know, giving yourself and your community that kind of legitimacy. They are a means of sort of reevaluating uh, what holiness is and also uh, giving queer people a chance to sort of view their experience and their culture as legitimate, valuable, special, and sacred. <laughs>